Hi folks, this is Greg at Best Choice Trailers. Today I'm going to take you for a walk around the Iron Bull 7x22 14,000 pound ETB series trailer. The trailer's got a few options on it. We'll take you around and show you those. Some of the features that are included here would be a 102 inch deck, drive over fenders, and full width loading ramps. A trailer like this is going to weigh in at about 4,000 pounds empty. It's going to have a roughly 10,000 pound legal payload plus your tongue weight of about 2,000 pounds. Let's take you around the trailer, show you some of the standard features. So we're going to start out up front. The trailer's got a six hole adjustable coupler. Notice it's got a cast coupler up front as well. It's got a built in safety chain holder, kind of neat little detail. Another thing they do that's nice on these, you can remount the jack up front or you can leave it at the back of the headache rack area kind of a neat little detail you got multiple placements to put your jack i prefer mine up front others prefer theirs in back okay on the 12k jack that they do standard on these they also do a ball bearing neat little detail makes the jack move a little bit more fluent like most trailers in the industry it's going to have a six inch channel mainframe and a six inch channel full wrap tongue so the tongue's going to wrap back to the spring hanger on the trailer it's got a sealed wiring harness on the trailer of course it's got your safety chains your breakaway all the legal requirements so this trailer is upgraded with a 102 inch deck for those not familiar you've got an 83 inch wide frame like your traditional trailers then we've got the outrigger that's going to take you out to 102 so your actual deck is about 96 and then your rub rail and whatnot is going to take you out to the 102. So another thing we like about Iron Bull, between each of the stake pockets and rub rail, they're going to put a chain spool or a pipe spool. So you got additional places to tie down. Then they've also got the D-ring tie downs as well. Lots of tie down points. These trailers are powder coated. Of course you got your reflector tape as well. Another feature we like on these, the drive over fenders, instead of being a six and a half foot fender like some, measure out at about nine, nine and a half, ten feet, depending on the trailer. So again, you get a much lower profile drive over fender, much more user friendly. <clears throat> we'll also take a look at them. They put gussets inside, front, middle, and back. So you've got plenty extra support. They're also using a heavy gauge driver or fender, I believe those are 7 gauge or 316. Also notice this one's got the upgraded aluminum wheels. Standard wheel would be steel, uh, silver or white, silver uh, mod or a white wagon wheel. These are upgraded to the uh, black inlay aluminums. 235 80R16 10 ply radial load range E would be standard tire. Dexter brand axles with the easy lube hubs and forward adjusting brakes are standard equipment. Also standard would be a slipper spring suspension. Notice there they've got the grease zert or what they would refer to as a wet bolt kit for added durability. <clears throat> Going to the back of the trailer, we've got the optional full width ramps. So we've got one ramp here folded over to show you it would be a self cleaning 22 foot deck. Something like this, you're gonna get a little over uh, three foot of beaver tail. So on a 22 footer, you got a little bit less than 19 foot of flat deck. Here's one of your ramps folded out. Now these particular ramps go pretty much the full width of the unit on a seven wide. On 102, you do have a little bit of a gap. Notice as well, these are double hinged ramps, not single hinged. And what I mean, many of these ramps spring up easily but to deploy them like that particular ramp, you'd have to work a little bit. Notice these here are what we would refer to as double sprung ramps. Fairly easy to pick up. Of course, again, you've got full width loading. These ramps will stand in the stand up position. It's another added benefit. I can't do it with one hand, <clears throat> but they will stand up similar to that. They've got bars that you can put on. So if you do have a 21 foot truck for instance a long bed full-size truck that measures 21 feet give or take you could stand them up like that so again you got about 18 and a half or so a flat about a three and a half foot beaver tail with stand-ups 
Folks, a couple other features we like. They do a 16 inch on center floor cross member, structural channel, two by eight treated pine decking. They also do a little bit nicer headache rack. We like how they design it. Kicks out just a little bit at the front. Again, all LED lights. They also have a, a phenomenal warranty on their trailers. It's what they call their 232 program or their ironclad warranty. They do a three year structural, two year comprehensive, and two year roadside assistance program. Again, folks, this is a Iron Bull by Northstar 7x22, 14,000 pound rated GVW. Comes in a number of different lengths. We also do these with slide in ramps and stand up ramps as well. Can also do them in a gooseneck model. If you have any questions on this or any of our other trailers, give us a ring 717 220 4220 or visit us on the web at bestchoicetrailers.com.